Hi, this is Project How To Do, my name is Konstantin, and today I'm going to show you how I made the extremely powerful 1 watt blue laser. If you're planning to make the same one, first thing you have to buy is laser safety goggles, because even the reflected rays can seriously damage your eyes. Be careful. This laser has lots of similar with the red one I used to make a few videos ago, but also it's about 5 times more powerful. We need the driver, which limits current through the diode, diode itself, focusing module, and a little heatsink. Links to everything as always in the description. Blue lasers become very popular last couple years, so our Chinese friends now making lots of different drivers for it. And just buy it is actually much easier and cheaper than make it by yourself. Because of specific of blue laser diodes, it has to be powered with about 5 volts. So there are two types of drivers. Step down, in case of you planning to use power supply over 5 volts, for example 2 lithium cells. This driver simply limits current through the diode and step up drivers in case if you want to use voltage lower than 5 volts. For example, one 18650 battery. For me, second one works better. My laser diode is 1 watt for 145 nanometers. You can find more powerful diodes in the same body, I saw maximum 3 watts. I using the same focusing module as in red laser, it's cheap 5 mW laser dot module. Also many people recommend to use special glass lens, instead of acrylic, that's what we have in our model but we are losing about 5% of power. I'm making this laser to play with it for an hour and then I'll forget it in the closet for years. So for me 5% doesn't really matter. Think by yourself. And last but not least heatsink. I don't remember why I bought this one instead of this, but it works fine. Would be better if I have thermal compound. First we have to read data sheets for the diode and driver. My diode's operating current is 1 amp and driver seller says that default current of it 1.3 amp, which is too much. We need to check it and adjust. I solder 3.3 ohm resistor to the out of driver, that gives us maximum 1.6 amp. Connect power to the driver, plus is red, minus is black. As you can see there are 1 amp limit, not 1.3 as seller says. But that's better for us. Anyway, check your driver before using. Now let's take out old laser diode from the model and press our 1 watt monster. Almost done. Just hold the diode to the driver and we are ready to turn it on. Don't forget about the goggles. I'm not going to make a nice body for this laser, because I'm very lazy and because I don't need that much power in my pocket. Probably that's it for today, like, share, subscribe, you know what to do. Also check my other videos, see you!